See that little girl over there? That's the little girl that Lionel's going to marry. Yeah, I know. And you know who that lady is hugging her? No. She's my wife. Oh, the car? <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. Really want to perpetrate because this 38 will be designated for all those that hate it like Jeff. Man, I'm contemplating your moves. You lose, now your hot, you gave me new moves. More dudes, now the top, you made me. Same rules, new food, now the budget. Do hey what's up y'all welcome back I am Van and we are all the LFR family and if you're not already with the LFR family I'm gonna need for you to hit that subscribe button right there Jack hit that thing all right guys today we about to watch some I remember all in the family featuring the Jeffersons again okay unless the Jeffersons invited all, um the family you know um Edith and Archie over to a function because I'm from the look of it right now it look like there's a lot of black people up in there so it's probably George Jefferson's function and plus his mother is up in there okay that's George Jefferson's no is that George Jefferson or is that Wheezy's mother I think is that Wheezy's mother or is that George Jefferson's mother I don't know um, but we about to see um, but this joint is called the n-word unbelieved from all in the family featuring George Jefferson I'm not gonna say anything while we play this, and I will have my um, my say at the end. Hopefully, you guys hang around, and um, and we can have a good conversation. Then it won't be long, I promise. All right, so let's go check this joint out. The N word unbleeped. All in the family, George Jefferson, son. Let's get it in. I really enjoy this, man. Let's do it. Grown up stuff right here. That's your third drink. I know that. Well, put it down. Mama, will you leave me alone, please? I said put it down. You've had enough. Look, Mama, I'm a big boy now. I don't need you to blow my nose for me. Now, will you leave me alone? Sure, huh? Hey there, Jefferson. That ain't very nice, talking that way to your little mammy here. Ooh, your little mammy here. Who you calling mammy? <laughs> well, don't you dare call me mammy. I'm nobody's mammy. I'm his mother. Now, if you've got anything to say to me, you call me Mrs. Jefferson. Oh, she's Mrs. Jefferson. Don't uh... talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> and don't you try to make a big either. Uh, mother Jefferson, what's wrong? No, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> George, what's going on? He called Mama Mammy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think I was doing that wrong. Well, I don't call her people call her mother's mammy. Well, I did, Jefferson. Oh, That's man. what I always said. Geez, Al Johnson called his mother Mammy for years. <laughs> yeah, Louise, you see, that's what you get for inviting white. By your whitey. All right. Oh, uh, uh, hey, if you're looking for the Elks Club, it's down the hall. <laughs> no, that's not in the right place. Oh, yeah? What are you, the caterer? <laughs> so what are you doing here, the white guy? I'm a guest. What are you doing here, a white guy? <laughs> I'm the family's white friend. <laughs> Jenny! Oh, my! You look beautiful. Oh, so do you, baby. So do you. You see that little girl over there? That's the little girl that Lionel's going to marry. Yeah, I know. You know who that lady is hugging her? No. She's my wife. Oh, the car? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, here we go. Here we go. Hi, Mr. Wells. Hi, Lionel. Oh, I see you met Mr. Bunker. Oh, we, we, we yeah, met. Yeah, we yeah. Well, Lionel, shouldn't we introduce my parents to yours? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Now, wait a minute, wait a minute there, Lionel. Hey, do you mean to tell me that your father ain't met that man? Uh, no, I'm going to introduce him right now. <laughs> this I got to see. <laughs> he said, this I got to see. <laughs> It's about to turn up, bro. Hey, Jefferson, you're going to love this. <laughs> okay, okay, Mom, Pop, this is Jenny's parents, Mr. and Mrs. Willis. <laughs> I'm very pleased to meet you. Oh, man. Okay, all right, all right. I don't know why this joint was called the N-word unbleeped. Why was it called that? Did I miss it? I didn't hear it. I, I swear to goodness I missed it. I swear to goodness. And I was listening for it. I was I was actually listening for it. That I let it be stuck on that deal. Because uh, that right there was something that was probably brought so much joy to Archie's heart, man. I could just imagine it. Just he was like, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So, oh, hold up, Lionel. Your, your, your parents haven't met them yet? Hasn't met him specifically? Oh, this is about to be good. This is about to be good. <laughs> All right. 
So the whole mammy thing, when he was talking to his mother, I, his, bless his mother's heart, trying to get um, George to stop drinking so much. I don't know what he was so stressed out about, but I kind of get it because they got these two young people about to join together and build their own families and it can be a, a bit stressful and as a matter of fact and I'm only sharing this with the people who are still here with me right now who are watching this this far along my oldest daughter just now was engaged today like she got engaged today um the young man called me asked me um for her hand in marriage and um because he he lives pretty far and um we had a good conversation and everything, but we too are about to face a situation, you know, like that. We're joining up the families. But anyway, so, you know, he's probably just stressed out about it, man. His son about to go marry somebody, and I don't know. And he's talking to Archie, one of his good friends, and they're having a good back and forth, as they always do. And then he calls his mom Mammy. The reason why that's a that's that's a no-no is because the 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 field slave or the house slave that used to help the um the master's wife or the mistress i don't know what they what they were called but the lady of the house helped her raise her children um they were called mammies back in the day if i'm wrong school me in the comments I listen, I'm not a historian, but I'm just telling y'all what I believe um to be true. And um and black women took offense to that back in the day. So whenever you called them mammy, they felt like you was calling them a house slave who was raising white children um of their slave owners. That's all that was. So of course she was on fire when when he said that. But of course, how can how how can Archie know that? But you know, he has this brilliant um ignorance about him and the ignorance is innocence because he's like look i i know people who call their mom this so i thought all colored people call their mom that so of course it comes off like oh sh because you saw when wheezy heard what he said she already knew like oh sh okay now i get it i get it he probably shouldn't have said that nah so the best part to me came up when uh when Archie walked over and was talking to him, was about to, I guess, I don't know if he was about to leave or walk to another side of the house or apartment or whatever. And the white dude stopped him and, and they introduced each other and they talking. And he was like, um, all right, so I know why I'm here because I'm their good friend. Why are you here? Are you the caterer? Or, you know, you running the business? To, you know, you providing the food? You're just checking up on everything? And, uh, and, then, he's, and, and then that's when the the wife well the future wife of Lionel uh, ran over there and you know they was all huggy dubby and everything he was just trying to figure out who they was and he said you see her mother right there that's my wife and that blew his mind and he was like hold up wait a minute wait 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 you're white she's black has George met you yet he was like no I'm gonna meet him tonight oh this is gonna be good so he then runs over to him because, you know, he like to instigate shit. He does. That's just what he does. That's what good friends do. Good friends like to instigate stuff. Oh, this is going to be good. I'm about to give me a front row seat, bring them up over there. And obviously, this was Wheezy's very first time meeting them too. But Wheezy's a little bit more chill than George. George like, whoa, look at his face. Look at his face. George wasn't ready for that, man. But it's good that he was. Why? Because this right here is how the world becomes great when people stop being afraid being on their own side their own team just running for them with their own race all the damn time because they think that this is the team i gotta be with and if i break this stance then i'm gonna be in a in a worse off a worse off situation than i was before i don't know man i don't know i thought that was brilliant um it was hilarious in my opinion and hopefully my take wasn't too long all right, pause. All right, but I want to hear what y'all got to say about this in the comments below. And if you have yet to check out all of our other Archie Bunker All in the Family reactions, please make sure y'all click that thing on your way out the door. Once again, guys, I am Van, and now we are all the LFR family, and I look forward to seeing y'all on the next video and hopefully inside the Patreon as well. Y'all have been amazing. Thank you so much for clicking play. Love y'all.
really wanna perpetrate, cause this 38 will be designated for all those that hate it like chess. Man, I'm contemplating your moves, you lose, now your hot, you gave me new moves, more dudes, now the top, you made me same rules, new moves, now the